Hey guys, and welcome back to Test Deckers. This is Gold here once again, and today we're doing a Battle in Boxer deck. Also, be known as uh, Burning Knucklers, but they changed that because they already had Fire Fists. Heh. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, today's deck is a little special because this is the first time we're ever going to be using XYZs. Okay, I'm going to stop here, us right here, before you even message me. I'm not dueling you with them, and this is a for uh, professional purpose. Not personal. Personal, I will duel you without these things, but without them, I don't care. Uh, alright, alright, clear. Yes, XYZs. Alright, that's the first time you're gonna see me use XYZs. Um, uh, this is the only way to run with this deck. I couldn't really find another deck that was working with me right now besides this one. So, uh, let's get to it, shall we? Uh, all of them are uh, battling boxers, so I'll just say the last part of names. So you got three counter punches, you got three glass jaws, three head geared. Uh, three spars and three switch hitters. That's it for the monsters. Let's move on to the spell cards. You have a dark coal, two double summonings, uh, one bullish burial, one heavy storm, one monster reborn, two mystical space typhoons, one rank up magic, variants, fours, uh, one reinforcement of the armies, two solidarities, uh, the warrior returning alive, and XYZ reception. That's it for spells. Let's go to trap cards now. You have uh, two compulsory evacuation devices, uh, one mind drain, one mere force, uh, two threatening roars, one trap to tribute, and one trap stun. And you have the XYZ block, XYZ reborn, and XYZ veil. That's it for traps in the main deck. Let's go on to the extra deck with the XYZ. So you have three battle and boxer lead yokes, uh, one number uh, 105 battle and boxer star cestus, and number C105 battle and boxer comet cestus. That's it for this. Uh, I'm gonna do something a little bit different here. I'm gonna explain a little, some of these cards a little bit like wider in here, uh, and some of them what they do, and some what I'm gonna do with them. Okay, this card, Counter Punch, I will never hit the field unless it's a last resort, because his effect only works when he's in your hand or graveyard. Uh, you have two double summoning here. It used to be three, but like I would dead draw it like twice and I was like this is not helping me so I only took one out and replaced it a little bit um, this card helps you get C105 out uh, this card can come in handy every now and then this card helps you because you'll usually send a box to the graveyard and then you can just add it right to your hand so there is a quick boost of 800 because you'll usually have a box in your uh, graveyard <coughs> see if I I have a mind drain here. This will really help if your opponent has like an effect veiler or monsters in their hand with effects. Stop them. It stops them. <laughs> Trust me, it really helps. It like almost it shut down an element dragon deck too. So I was like, yes. Uh, and the rest of these cards are pretty much uh, stun your opponent till you can get like more of these out, so you can get more X Y Z's out. That's pretty much the deck. Stall so you get more of your monsters out. That's pretty much it is. Like so that's the end of this the dueling portion. Uh, comment if you want me to do more videos like this explaining it a little bit more. If you want to explain it more than this, or if you just want me to go back to doing it like just say what's in the deck and go into the next portion of the video. But whatever, uh, I'll see you guys with the dueling portion later. So, bye. Hello and welcome back to Test Deckers. This is Gold once again and we are with the dueling portion of our video. I'm gonna activate the effect. Send the guy send one guy to the graveyard. I usually play pick glass chair off. Mm. Uh, do I wanna do I want to do I wanna do I want to I'll set this on my turn. Activate these. The grave. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Draw a monster next turn. That's all I need is one monster next turn. My best one I can draw right now is switch hitter. Any others is fine right now. <laughs> Dang it.
1,500 attack, 1,000 defense, okay? I'll have to wait for it. Now at back now at three thousand. Back and now at three thousand. <laughs> Bingo. No traps for do. No traps. I was gonna save that for my next attack, but if he's kind of that desperate, oh, huh. normal summon. I have to go for this. Bad things. Attack directly. Two thousand. Oh, five thousand. End my turn. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Come on, come on, come on! Oh. Okay. I guess that's the end of the duel. I'll see you guys with the review portion later. Bye. Hello, and welcome back with the review portion of this video after that easy duel. <laughs> Usually my duels don't go easy like that, but uh, I guess when you go 5,000 right out of the, right the bell ring, you're kind of set there. Uh... Today's MVP is uh, Burning Knuckle Battle Inboxer Switch Hitter. Uh, uh, I can't talk how should I say them, but I like. No, it was going on. Okay. Uh, let's just get this started. As we always, the pros are on the left, the cons are on the right. Let's get to this. Okay. We got an easy loop. First turn out, you can pretty much. First or second turn, you can pretty much get your 105 or your two um, lead yokes out. Pretty easy, just like that. First or second turn is not that hard to stall. Get them out. Uh, these guys are heavy hitters, as you just saw. Five thousand on what? Second or third turn? Five thousand. Boom, boom, and just kept powering up. Um, okay, that leaves me to power up. Lead joke. Every time it attaches, that's eight hundred. Solidarity. When I put in this deck, gives them another eight hundred for another. There's another battle and boxer in there, which is there usually is always. Uh, counter punch gives a thousand when a battle and boxer, found a knuckle, is in a battle, either being attacked or is attacking. It gives him a thousand. That's a lot of power right there. Do not underestimate these guys. And finally, these guys will not go down without a fight. If I have two lead jokes out, you gotta have at least five cards to dest that destroy my. Monsters to touch them, really. And every your monsters probably won't be enough. Was supposed to destroy my battle. I just like take one off, and the guy goes with the three thousand, and he's still on the field. Uh, one hundred five. Opponent takes all the damage, and their effects are negated. So don't rely on monster effects when you go into these. They will <laughs> not go down without a fight. Alright, time for cons. No one likes the cons. Don't overdo it. Like, don't use... Make sure... Like, if it's the first or second turn, you're probably fine using... Like, getting, uh, like, four monsters on... Four or five monsters on the field. That's fine. Get a lead yoke out in 105 or two lead yokes in 105 and probably a 2,000 feet stick out there. Yeah. Uh, miss them. Make sure you don't miss them, because, like... Uh, if you have uh, Spar and... Uh, Switch in your hand, you really can only act. You can only. You should activate Spar first and then Switch Air. But if you activate Switch Air first, you can't summon Spar. You can't special summon for your rest of your turn. Uh, end it early. It's kind of. It's kind of a neutral thing right now. I 
think it's kind of neutral, but you want end it. Early. It's good to end thing, end it early, but it's also bad because if you don't end it early, like you don't want to be dragged on and on through a long duel. You will be destroyed. I know. Um, and finally, eighty percent sure. When you're attacking with guys, try to be at least eighty percent sure that whatever your opponent's going to do, you can counter it. Like to activate a monster effect, make sure you have like a 105 out there to activate his effect. You have they have like they activate Dark Cold, make sure you have a um, lead joke out there to negate that. And this is I don't see why pe people don't get this. When lead jokes effect, when a uh, battling boxer or boxer, but when a battling boxer monster or mon monster parentheses monsters there monsters. Is the is going to be destroyed by value? You can detach one of your and negate it, pretty much. I don't see a lot of people don't get that. I can't just fight with like two other people with this. I don't get it. Um. Uh. Let's see what else? Anything else? Um. Uh. Not much here. Um. Uh, sorry if this was kind of a weird episode. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. It's time to rate the deck. Um, I give this deck a solid eight out of ten, or eight point five. They like point five. Oh, point five. Eight. Eight point five. Eight. <laughs> I can't make up my mind. Get about an 8 out of 10 with this deck. This deck is like a 10. So, uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, make sure to like, subscribe, and favorite this video. I would really enjoy it. Um, uh, if you like this deck or you want to see another deck, post the link in the description below. If I forget to mention anything, it'll be in the description below. And the deck list will be in the description below, as always. Um, if you think we, I should do another deck, anything really, just suggest it might do it. I'm trying to get here Rustic over here. I'm now on summer break, so is he, so try and get him every over here maybe sometime. You'll most likely get it. Maybe towards the end of summer most likely. That's when he usually comes over. But you'll get one sooner or later. Uh anything else I forget is uh is gonna be in the description below. So I'll see you guys next time. This is the gold. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. When you see this video. Bye. That was awkward.